people, people, it's no interruptions. That means you cannot stop me while I'm talking. I got something to say. Yes, I'm and we're talking about this Montgomery brawl, Montgomery which brawl. has made history. Folks yes. are getting tattoos and everything. <laughs> Of a chair. Look. I gotta get me a tattoo. Come on, Alabama. I want one with the cap up in the air. The Come on, cap. Alabama. That's okay. the back cap, not uh-huh. the black cap. It's the back. The cap. back cap. I wonder what made him throw his hat up like that. Because he did it. You know what? He was like, you know what? It's going down today. Let's it's go. On. It's on. Let's go. <laughs> so let's go. go. Hit me. <laughs> Boom. Boom. Let's go. <laughs> But I love the reenactment too, because that had me in tears. I was up last night, like <laughs> this is crazy. Oh. But I love the creativity because I love in our community that we take things seriously, yeah. but we also Make do not. Yeah, we yeah. find because humor in it. it but, but but which is a, a trauma response, right? Right. We have to find humor in all this crap that we go through. Yeah. You know, we got to find some kind of joy in it. Uh, yeah. But I mean, I don't know. People are upset that many of us are happy because, baby, I was like, ha ha, that's what you get. But it's it's about it's long overdue. This is built up aggression. We we done sat through it's the George up. Floyd's. We, we've been going through stuff. The Trayvon Martins. Right. We, we tired. The Proud Boys. Trump. Right. We were stuck. Just, just. Tr- look. You said it. Trump then gave these people a false narrative. Baby, Trump ain't going to save you. No, he ain't. Okay? No. But these hands going to show you something. <laughs> okay? You going to have to I, I was feeling eyes. some type of way for a minute because I've seen a lot of women getting hit. And that bothered me because I think you shouldn't put your hands on a woman. My, then my other thought was they shouldn't even be in the fight. How about What are you doing right. jumping in a fight when mm-hmm. men mm-hmm. Are, are stirred up like exactly. that? You put yourself in the situation because exactly. when the adrenaline is flowing, I'm popping. swinging on everybody. Thank you. I'm swinging on everybody look like the opposition. Exactly. If you look like an op, I'm tagging. Exactly. <laughs> and, they will, and anytime you jumping in like that, one girl, they tossed in the water. Well, that's I her said, fault. Oh, Lord, get the that's her fault. I said, Lord, get her, please. You want to be a intervene. man and you won't get handled like but she, a man. But she she was being beat up by women, so let's clear that up. No, a dude no, no, no. in the water. No, no, those are two women. Those are two women. They had short hair. That those are oh, women. Lord. Well, that was a woman. Those were two women oh, beating geez. up the girl. <laughs> now it was a man that was hitting a woman over the head with the chick. <laughs> that you know what? I ain't gonna lie. I laughed so hard watching oh, that man bop her. He, is he was like, boom. Now that listen, that was that was. I you know what? Bittersweet for me. But he but. You hear what I'm saying? Yeah. You can't hit a woman like that. If a woman, a woman don't need to hit a man. I'm, we need to stop this narrative. A man can't hit a woman. If somebody hits you, you hit them back. Man, woman, dog, roach, I don't care. <laughs> Keep your hands to yourself. I was just taught better than that. I don't care. I was taught better than that. I, just, I don't think it's fair to can't. a man. Let me say this. Let's say this. Because of the history of behind everybody, and I don't, I don't want to focus on just a particular group of people, but since it is a black and white thing, mm-hmm. Uh, Caucasian women have been the cause of a lot of black men mm-hmm. being killed. Yep. So that's Ooh. built up aggression. Yeah, built up aggression. Where I'm getting this from grandma, me yep. That's right. Medea. That's right. Great grandma. All these people. So right. look at Emmett Till. Yes. And the lady was still alive. She just she, she just got to died. she got to live her full life and die mm-hmm. without going to jail mm-hmm. for. For falsely accusing falsely him. And he died. And he died at 14. 14 years old. He would have been 82 years old if he was still alive or 89. Now, that was horrible what they did to Emmett Till. Yeah. And what his mother had to endure. I was watching the movie. You had it on. Mm-hmm. You I fell, fell asleep. asleep. <laughs> <laughs> but I watched the entire film, and it was incredible. And what they did to him was unbelievable. Mm-hmm. And the fact that they were bold about it. hmm and that's what bothers me. And right. people are very bold with their racism. Very. And so we should be very bold with our resistance against it. Mm-hmm. And I think that's what we've seen at the Montgomery Brawl, brawl uh, is that people are just, we're fed up with yep. it. We're bold with our resistance. And people are coming to the fight. Like, you know. Gotta have a Nat Turner spirit. <laughs> yes. I, I, you know what? If I was there on the boat, I can't even say I wouldn't have been in the fight. I would have been right there in the middle of it. I can't you know swim, but I can shoot. <laughs> and, and it's sad because I, I, I am Dietrich Haddon. You know, people do know me as a gospel singer and bring it peace. But if I see a situation like that, man, but you know, I don't know, man. You brought you just brought up something. Back in the days, the church was out there on the front lines. The church was talking about what was going on, right. not being quiet. So we need somebody from the church to say, "Hey, this ain't cool." Let's keep going, y'all. We'll be right back talking about this Montgomery brawl. We own it. We own it. Here's Karen Clark Shear, y'all. Let's go.